through. Slam. Oh, they're yes. dancing forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. I've been talking lately about the Fight Pass 5, but are you aware that before Fight Pass 5, we will be having the Chapter 2 update? Gamernom, are you sure? Actually, no, but I'm confident because they just released the Fight Pass 4 and most of the players haven't finished it yet. The question is, were you able to finish Chapter 1? Were you able to finish the quests from these guys, find Finrel? do something productive yes i will fin real later after this video or even defeat inferno boss and unlock the boss drops were you able to do that guys well you still have time but for chapter 2 guys what if they return the previous bosses the christmas boss the easter boss as a side quest remember chapter 1 they gave us quests such as defeating korama defeating broly and the beast king right what if they return that to give us another chance to unlock those boss drops, right? Especially to those new to the game, check this out under Bulma's capsule. That is the, where the Christmas boss is located. Again, Christmas boss, Christmas event. There you go. If you're new, you really have no idea who is this boss. Check this out, Nicholas the Renegade. Oh, I remember this part where I decreased the graphic mode because my laptop is lagging. There you go. So this boss has two skills, which is very helpful, especially in jog mode right now. I'm gonna show you to this one. The ice explosion, there you go. It deals huge damage and it deflects attacks. I'll show that to you later. You know why are you showing this? I hope that the developers see this, so maybe they'll put those boss back, even just for a chapter. Next up, the ice spikes. Did you see the spikes around him? So let's share, 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 <laughs> so that the uh, developers will have an idea. Okay, so that would be it, guys. Uh, is this boss very hard to defeat? No, no. There's a technique wherein you can just stock this boss in a tree, yes, and you will be able to defeat him. <laughs> so guys, I will be fast forwarding this. Uh, if you want, you can watch or fast forward this, because I'll just defeat this. For those asking about the thing that I'm talking about, you can what they call this stock this in a tree and you can go long range. Use the grimoires to defeat this. I have a video of that. There you go, it's fast forwarded now. Question gamer gnome. Who's the hardest boss? Inferno, Carrot, or Nicholas the Renegade? For me, it's still Inferno boss, guys. That boss is very hard. Next is, hmm, I think it's Carrot, because Carrot is so fast, and he was able to dodge most of the skills, etc. And this is the easiest, even though you cannot defeat this that fast. The damage of this is kind of low, there you go. Guys, I'm gonna show it to you. Did you see that? This is the ice explosion, check it out. Every time my dummy account is trying to attack my main account, you see that their seconds are being deflected. So cool. Again, boom! See that? Oh, it's so cool, guys. Who wants that? Next up, the ice spikes. So see here, I am looking at the dark demon. Let's go attack it with the ice spikes. So, okay. Fly towards him, guys. I want you to check the HP. Oh, did you see that? <laughs> again, again, again. Check the HP. Oh, it's ticking down very fast, right? One more time. Oh, so, so, is it cool? Yes, it's so cool. If you don't have the other skills, you can always use this to defeat bosses. Big bosses, especially Kurama and Beast King. Uh, but I don't suggest it with Broly and the other one. Is that? Uh, mass Villain. Not so good. There's even a bug that you can one hit KO Inferno boss with that, but they nerfed gone, so okay. Next boss, Carrot Boss. Yeah, if you're new to the game, you still I know you were still able to witness this boss, but I know most of you were not able to unlock the boss drops. 
there's still lots of bugs during this update. So yeah, I know most of you were not able to unlock it. You have two skills. The jump flip shock and the ground shock. As both of them have stuns on their name. There's shock on it. <laughs> so yeah, is there an easy way to defeat this? There is. Just jump on the tree, etc. Is it beatable without that strategy? Yes, you can beat it with, without using that strategy. There you go. So Gamer Nom, why do you want to return this? boss drops guys they're so good i'm going to show it to you first is the jump flip shock guys this is a stun imagine power that has stun we only have two ice blast and uh conqueror's hockey if you add this to you have four stuns now see that 30 damage here where your cursor points your character will jump on it and check the jump flip Ooh, it's so cool 30 damage guys that's so cool you go oops there's a tricycle if you ever hear that 30 damage with a stun okay you see that the enemy cannot run the ta the moment that we hit him with the kick or the jump flip shock one more time there you go that's the range so is this effective in tournament dimension guys it is it's so good it's just that we cannot maximize it now because of the jug mode <laughs> sorry about that okay just showing the range next up we have the ground shock so you need this this is kind of short or mid range see that it's kind of far away you need to like use the the jump flick shot if you're near use the ground shot again this has a mini stun 20 damage compared to 30 damage not bad again think of this conquerors hockey the ice blast plus this jump flick and the ground smash all has a stuns oh, so cool right okay now we're gonna try it with some buffs explosive nova escanor there you go. Let's see the damage. I'm, I'm thinking now what if we include uh, severed slashes with this. We can go near our enemy and stun him. Only stun. <laughs> Spam stun. Let's go. Let's check it out. Hmm. 104 damage. Not bad. Enemies only have like 100 uh, 250 HP. Oh, Gamer no. What if he has like uh, what do you call this? 70 damage for the ground smash. Champions and explosive Nova 2. Not a problem. Let's use other skills. We're not just gonna use these two, right? Okay, let's try the blazing kick. Okay, blazing kick. Stun, stun, stun. Oh, not bad, right? So what do you think? Should the developers put it back as a side quest? Is it unfair for the ones who finish it? Comment it on the comment section. Again, guys, don't forget to share this video so that the developers will see this. Again, this is GamerNom, and GamerNom out!